Okay, today we're doing black holes. They actually stretch his light. So, it, you, if you go to the other side, it just stretches. If you look and you look when, when you're on the other side, it just stretches light. Like, the light is just like stretched. And even you would be stretched by the singularity. That's why mommy zoomed in on here. Now, this is the first ever um, taking photo of a black hole. I need to look down here. See that little picture? This is what the earth, this is what I just said. By this, it just bends light. And if you don't believe me, this happens to Earth if it's on the other side. If you're and you're on the other side, that happens to a wormhole. This can be possibly almost go through the universe. It's just mind blowing. We we haven't discovered it yet. Look. That's light, that's, nothing can escape it. That's why I zoomed in close. And this is what a black hole looks like. This big picture in the middle, it's what the black hole looks like. It has a black hole around it it because of the light it just looks a little bit wonky but even look so if like an object gets like near to singularity or farther to the singularity they when it's like on the edge of like, of like this disc, they get sucked in instantly. But it doesn't go instantly. It just the slower you're out in, the slower you're out in, the more outer you are, the more slower it gets in. And then, and then singularity is just going faster than the speed of. And the speed of light can't make it um, away from a black hole. That's how fast you have to move to get away from a black hole. It has that even brighter than like millions of stars. What? That's mind blowing. 